Okay, it's Thursday morning, South Florida, TGIT. We've almost made it to the weekend. I'm JC Birch, enjoying. Still have the doors and windows open, yeah. even though it's warmer. Yeah, it's feeling lovely, Still though. Still had them open. Now we're right in that sweet spot. Hey, South Florida, I'm Eric Yetzi. We are watching breaking news for you this morning. Two officers shot overnight during a shootout with another person. Let's get straight to Local 10's Annalise Garcia. She is live in Southwest Miami-Dade with the very latest details. Annalise. Hey, good morning, JC Eric. So we now know two Miami-Dade police officers were shot, but they are expected to be okay. The subject who fired that gun is now dead. The director of Miami-Dade police did say, by the grace of God, these officers are okay. Two Miami-Dade police officers shot Wednesday night, now expected to be okay. We have learned that officers responded to a house with squatters inside. The squatter was armed with a shotgun pointing at us. When officers approached the front door at the house located on Southwest 162nd Avenue in Cutler Bay, the subject fired a shotgun. He was given multiple orders to drop the weapon, and he fired at the officers. One of those officers, 35 years old, shot in the upper body. The other, 57, shot in the upper body and the face. And we returned fire. Miami-Dade police tells us the officers shot back and the subject is now dead. Both officers were immediately transported to Jackson South, where they are now recovering. Director Stephanie Daniels addressed the situation by saying, quote, This type of violence towards my officers will not be tolerated. By the grace of God, they are alive today. So we are working to get some more information on the subject and what exactly they were doing inside this house. Uh, we are also working to get more information on how these officers are doing. Uh, that's obviously very developing, but again, fortunately, they are okay. This was a very close call. We are live in Southwest Miami-Dade. And Elise Garcia, Local 10 News. Our team coverage continues right now with Local 10's Syra Onward. She's live at the scene with more information. Syra. So I can tell you this is where this whole uh, deadly scene unfolded here in Southwest Miami-Dade. You can see there are still uh, Miami-Dade police units, crime scene investigators out here. We do know the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is investigating the shooting. Again, a very close call uh, for multiple officers. Again, what we know, what uh, Annalise Garcia just told us about, the South District Uniform Patrol officers uh, arrived to a home here to conduct an investigation. And as officers came up to the front door, they were confronted by a man with a shotgun. He shot at the officers. At least one officer shot back. Uh, a 35-year-old officer was shot. Police say uh, that wound was to the upper extremity. The second officer, a 57-year-old man, was also shot in the upper extremity and in the face. Uh, other officers rushed the two to Jackson South, where uh, Annalise is. A third officer, a 40-year-old woman, was also taken to the hospital for a medical evaluation. That armed man who was uh, also shot was pronounced dead on the scene. So you can see these officers out here uh, continuing their investigation. Again, the Florida Department of Law Enforcement is looking into this, but they are still asking uh, more people to come forward. They're asking anyone with information on this crime uh, to call Miami-Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. I will let you know what we gather uh, from the crime scene here as the morning develops, but that is the very latest live here in Southwest Miami-Dade. Syra Onwar, Local 10 News.